I'm Simon Bolak! I told you to never say that name in my presence. Hmm. Awesome. The life of a gentleman footballer. Puh. So he does a bit of charity work, saves a few whales, and is a male model. Whatever. Who's gonna buy his book? Come on, Daniel. If anyone deserves a book around here, it's me. <laughs> hey, are you thinking what I'm thinking, Daniel? Snack time? No. You're gonna write my biography. Platana, birth of a god. Yeah! But I don't know how. Go get Bolak out of the garbage. We're gonna write a bestseller. No need, Eriko. I bought two. Right, so how does that loser's story begin? His Nobel Peace Prize? His Orphan Foundation? Nope! 50 pages of acknowledgments! Bootlicker! So, who do you want to thank? Nobody. Really? Go on, next chapter. You can't be serious. There has to be someone you want to thank. A coach, a sponsor, a hairdresser! Oh, well, if you put it that way, sure. Ah! I can thank my right foot and my left foot. That's it? Platana is a self-made man. Whew, I am spent. You type all that up, because I'm going to go watch TV. Hmm. There has to be somebody. I know it! Surprise! This is your surprise? Mm -hmm. I know this statue. I was there for the unveiling. I mean, I was late, but, you know, I was there. Wait for it. Recognize him? It's Lario, your former teammate. You play together as juniors. He assisted all your goals? He was your best friend? He gave you a kidney? He rescued your family from a fire? Oh, yeah, Flavio? No, Lario! He made you the best player in the world. That deserves a little thank you, don't you think? Platana owes nothing to no one. Especially not some guy with no pants. Eriko? Is that you? I'd know that voice anywhere. Well, uh, so now you're a ball? Ah, uh, no. Hey, I'm not judging. We've all got our own issues. <laughs> It's so good to see you. How long has it been? Yeah! 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 We're the best. We're gonna rip the Chiriquitos to shreds on Saturday. I have one position available at my club in Europe. Which one of you is coming with me, hmm? Can't you take both of us? Listen, boys, if you don't want to be rich and famous, that's your problem. But I've got a plane to catch, so hurry up and decide. You're my best friend, Eriko, and this is your dream. So if you want to go, I leave it to you. <laughs> Do you need your cleats? Mine have holes in them. Uh... Can I take your shirt and shorts, too? Otherwise, it's kind of a mismatch. Good luck, Eriko! I'll never forget you! And I never did. Whoa! He gave you the spot? That deserves a little gratitude, right? Um... Nah, not feel it. <laughs> it was great seeing you again! Till next time! We can't leave him like that. We could at least have him over for a snack. Eh? In your dreams. Whoa! And that's the final where you scored 12 goals, huh? 
Yeah, 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 yeah. You could be nicer after all he's done for you. Hey, you were the one who asked him over. He was your friend, and you're treating him like a stranger. Shh, don't shout, he'll hear you. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess I better be going. I don't want to bother you. I'll show you out. I'm sorry that Erico's a bit... Erico. Uh, he's always been a bit grumpy, but deep down, he's got a heart of gold. To a friend who has a special place in my heart. He gave it to me when we were ten. He plays it cool, but he's really a softie. Erico, will we still be friends when you get your body back? <laughs> oh. You're serious? Don't worry, Lionel. You and me were friends for life. It's Daniel! Lionel Daniel was a difference. Uh, that's it! If you don't get off that couch and go thank Larry before I count to ten, I'm gonna... You're gonna what? I'm gonna publish your unauthorized biography, Platana, the Dark Side. Shh. Platana, the Dark Side. <laughs> There's even an entire chapter on that hair dye disaster of 2002! Lario? Lario! Oh well, he's not here. Too bad. We'll find him sooner if we split up. Lario! Lario! No! Oh, seriously? Oh, come on! What is with everyone today? Back off, bird! <laughs> Eight against one, huh? Is that all you got? Oh. <laughs> okay. Got a large family. Lario! Ah, Lario! There you are! Oh, yeah! That's me! Erico! I found him! <laughs> <laughs> Hold, Hold on, on Erico! Plutana hmm? doesn't need nobody! Nobody! Plutana <laughs> needs someone! Someone! Anyone! Don't worry. I know these birds. Situation under control, I could have easily managed on my own. Erico? <sniffs> okay. Thank you, Lario, for helping me with that pigeon. <clears throat> uh, and thank you for giving me that spot when the scout came. Without you, I could have never had a career. Ah, uh, anytime. And thanks for the money I borrowed without asking. Right, right. And for forgiving me for what happened after your mom's birthday party. Right, right. Right. Then I think we're good. What more can I possibly do? Well, I have an idea. And this is how we became best friends. End of the tour. 
So, what's with that other pedestal next to the statue? Oh, that? That's just in case I need to add another statue one day. Of the person who helps me get my body back, for example. <laughs> Don't get ahead of yourself, okay? I didn't say I was gonna do it, I said I was thinking about it. How about we finish your biography? Sure. Ooh, I have a better idea for a title. Platana, the world at his feet. Ooh, or maybe Platana, in all his modesty. What is this nightmare? It's our annual club fair! There's Hit the Cans, the Sack Race, the Hook a Duck Stand, the Lemonade Stand, Clairvoyance, hey, that's new, the Claw Machine, the Face Painting Stand, and. Dunk a Clown! Step right up, step right up, come try your luck! I know a clown who needs a good dunk. I've already won all the other games. The ping pong contest, whack-a-mole, skittles, but I've never won it. Dunk a clown. How hard can it be? To dunk the clown, you have to hit the target with the ball. But the ball is tiny, and the target is really far away. Come on, Steven, you can do it. Winning is just losing with a smile. Darn clown! Anyway, where do we start? I like to warm up with a few rounds at Hit the Cans. Erico? You wanna see the fortune teller? Nah, me superstitious. Come on, I don't believe in that stuff. See you at Hit the Cans. I'm not some chump! Everyone knows fortune telling's for chumps! Chumps! Hello? Come closer, my child. Closer. Welcome to the cave of mystery and magic. Have no fear. Take a seat. Hey, you're the guy who turned me into a ball. Hey, what do you know? Small world, isn't it? So, you want to know your future, huh? I just want to know if Daniel will be a champion. Will I get my body back one day or not? Palm reading, tarot cards, astrology, numerology. Crystal ball. Oh, I see you're a man of culture. Uh... Just a minute. Daniel Sisu, winning this World Cup has officially made you the greatest footballer in history. When did you realize you had it in you to become a champ, huh? Don't laugh, but I think it was the day I won at Dunk a Clown at my football's club annual fair. <laughs> With this new record, you've even dethroned Erico Platana. Any thoughts? <gasps> what? Did you get a good look? I can never see. Daniel's gonna be better than me? Daniel? It can't be. No one outdoes Erico Platana. The future isn't set in stone, you know. If you act now, you can still change its course. Yes! Yes! To think that one day he'll betray me. After everything I've done for him, he'll stab me in the back with his pudgy little hands. Look what I won, Erico! Huh? What did you win, you dirty little rat? A giant teddy! Oh, how adorable! You'll get what's coming to you, you snake in the grass. I won at the sack race, hit the cans, and the pancake stand. Everyone wins there. Oh, that is so awesome. You ready to go then? We had fun. You won your stuffed animals, we're good to go, right? No, Erico. I have to win at Dunk a Clown. It's my destiny! I can feel it. Wait, don't you want to play something else? Another round of hit the cans, uh, hook the duck? No! Yoo-hoo, Daniel! I can do it, Erico. I feel it in my bones. This time is it. No, wait!
I mean, uh, come on, champ, you can do it. It doesn't matter how you hold the ball. Huh? Am I holding the ball wrong? Yeah, forget what I said. The main thing is to not crumble under pressure, even if all your friends are watching you. Watching you. I don't know, Eriko. I think I'm starting to feel like I might crumble. Oh, it's no big deal, Daniel. Just don't focus on maybe missing the target. Forget all about the pounding in your chest. Your sweaty palms. Shallow breathing. <laughs> or how the target seems to be shrinking. And most of all, never, ever, ever. I quit. <laughs> Oh, what a shame! You were off to such a good start! You know the best part about not trying? Not losing. Nothing wrong with knowing your place. You chose wisely, Daniel. Lame! Well, you have fun. Let me know if you get a bite. Hey, there you go. Who's the champ now? You know, Eriko, you really have to go in little circles because otherwise you leave marks. If you say so. Yeah! <laughs> if Daniel doesn't become a champion, I'll be a ball forever. The future isn't set in stone, you know. If you act now, you can... Yeah, 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 I know, I got it. Hey, cut that out right now. It's because I burst the paddling pool. I failed at that, too. Listen up, kiddo. You're a champ, and champs don't mop floors. Is that why you never do chores? Don't change the subject. You gotta fight, Daniel. You gotta take risks. I want my body back. But you're the one who told me I should know my place, and that if you never try, you never fail. I said that? Yep. And not to give myself false hope, and that if I didn't dream too big, I wouldn't be disappointed, and... You gotta become a champ, okay? A champ! A champ like you? Exactly like me. Wait, I mean, not as good. Like me, but not as good. Why not as good? Because no one's better than me, got it? That's why I threw you off earlier, so you wouldn't get big-headed. You tried to throw me off on purpose? <sighs> I just wanted to sap your confidence a bit. You know, in the hopes that you'd abandon your dreams. Okay, true. When you put it like that, it doesn't sound great. Daniel! Don't be like that! Huh, he's angry now, but he'll get over it. Daniel Sisu, this is the twelfth book you've written criticizing Eriko Platana. Why so much hatred for a former footballer no one remembers? He knows! Okay, I gotta stop all this before it goes too far. Eriko Platana is a big fat meanie, and he's got a huge chin. End of prologue. Daniel, can I talk to you for a second? Hmm. <sighs> I just wanted to say... I'm sorry, I panicked, because one day, one day you'll be better than me. Forget it, Eriko. I know you don't mean that. No, it's true, I promise. Do you really think so? I know so. And you know why? Because you've got the best coach in the world, me. So we're going back to that dunk -of clown stand, and you're going to give that big clown the dunk of his life. Yoo-hoo, Daniel! Breathe deeply. Bend your knees, nice and steady. It's just you and the target. <sighs> you almost hit it. Lame! <laughs> Daniel, don't say I never do anything for you. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel! Daniel, Daniel. Ah! Daniel Sisu.
Sue, winning this World Cup has officially made you the greatest footballer in history. When did you realize you had it in you to become a champ? Don't laugh, but I think it was the day I won at Dunk a Clown at my football club's annual fair. <laughs> With this new record, you've even dethroned Erico Platana. Any thoughts? I think my coach is gonna be really happy. He taught me everything I know. It's like I always say, only Coach Platana can turn a donkey into a racehorse. Yes, I did it. I'm glad you're so confident. My visions are not the most reliable, you know. What? No, I am getting my body back. I, I saw it. Everyone knows fortune telling is for chumps. Hmm? For chumps? Con man! You okay, Eriko? Yeah, just never trust bald guys who can unscrew their heads. Okay! Hey, what'd you do with your teddy bear? I left it with Steven for a ping pong match. Nine zero? You're getting cream, Steven. <laughs> Lame. Wow, what's up with the new look? Laundry day. The only thing left was my chic suit. <laughs> you call that chic? Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Clothes are my thing. You know what they call me? King Drama? Master Red Card? The Backstabber? What? No, my other nickname. Big Chin? No, Style Man, the Prince of Fashion. Okay, we gotta go shopping. Yeah! Shopping! Uh, I'm not sure about this, Erico. Oh, you look marvelous. Stylish, suave, masculine. <laughs> Makes me want to call you Monsieur. I'm off to work. Mm -hmm. There's some leftover lasagna in the fridge. <gasps> Daniel, what are you doing dressed like that? Are you in a gang? You don't like it? <laughs> mm. This cost a fortune. Where did you get the money for this? <gasps> don't tell me you're bullying your friends from football and taking their money. What? No way. No, oh, you're turning into a delinquent and it's all my fault. Ever since I took on that third job, we barely see each other anymore. You know what? I'll take the day off when we can go to the movies. All right, sweetie. Uh, Mom! Check it! The new robot combat fighter is out! The explosions are in 3D! <laughs> Sweet dreams in 2D, honey. Mm. Good night, Mom. And all because your mom thinks you're going astray. <laughs> Me, a gangster. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Daniel? Hmm. Didn't you want to go to the carnival? No, Erico. Lying to mom is wrong. Daniel, what were you thinking? I don't know what's gotten into him recently. It seems pretty clear to me. A kid needs his mom. Take him to the carnival or go-karting. Or out for a meal. Oh, Chinese would be great. <sighs> what am I going to do with you, Daniel Sisu? <sighs> okay, grab your coat. We're going out to dinner. <laughs> Daniel, I'm getting really worried about you. You're not just doing this so we spend more time together, are you? <laughs> no, no! I don't know why. I just can't keep out of trouble. <sighs> I got mixed up in some bad stuff when I was your age, too. Believe me, it's not worth it. So, time to toe the line, okay, honey? 
I promise, Mom. Mm. Good night, bad boy. Are you a deep sea diving or winter sports kind of guy? Winter sports? Deep sea diving. Deep sea diving. Winter sports? No, Erico, it's over now. You don't mean that. Your mom's so close to taking us on vacation. I don't want to lie to her anymore. My thug life is over. Okay, Daniel. You leave me no choice. Time to get up, sleepyhead. Breakfast is ready. <gasps> Hey, what's the problem? Daniel, tropical paradise, here we come! What did you do this for? And where did you get all this money? Relax, it's all fake. The armored truck, the cash, even the Italian <laughs> shoes. Hmm? <gasps> uh. Okay, Daniel, I get it. This is the life you want, and there's nothing I can do to change that. But I'm still your mother! If you can't help but become a criminal, we'll do it together as a family. Come on, get in. Mm. Mom, I don't think this is such a good idea. The Sisu crew is in the... Buckle up, honey. The Sisu crew is in the house. <laughs> you okay, Daniel? Still up for the thug life? <laughs> You just wait here for a second, okay, sweetie? Mama's gonna rob a bank. She's bluffing. You don't really buy her gangster act, do ya? She's not gonna do it. Huh? Hey, that's my money! Oh, oh no. no! She, she did, did it! it. Yeah, uh, how old's your mom? 30-something. Yes, a 30-something woman, short hair, the car has flames on the side, come quick. Hey! You can't tell on her, she's my mom! Yeah. <laughs> Thing I know a guy. <laughs> yeah, right, I know. It's been quite a while. Your mom's gone crazy, Daniel! Tell her the truth! But then she'll know I lied! Who cares? This has gone too far! Tell her! <laughs> you okay, Daniel? Nothing to tell me? Uh uh. Okay, off we go. The mountain is waiting for us. Are we going skiing? <laughs> <laughs> no, the mountain is the most wanted criminal in the city. Get the money. If things go bad, just run and don't look back. Got it? I can't leave her alone! <laughs> nope, stay here, Daniel. That guy looks really dangerous! You got the cash? I gotta help my mom! It's too late for that, Daniel! Let go of the bag! We can still make it out of here if we get rid of it! No bag, no evidence, no problem! <laughs> 
You're under arrest. <laughs> the mountain's a cop. We gotta move it fast. <laughs> Nothing to tell me, Daniel. As you wish. I made it all up so you would spend time with me. I'm sorry I lied. Daniel Sisu, promise me you'll never lie to me again. I promise, Bobby. Please, get out of the vehicle with your hands up. I don't want to go to jail! <laughs> Mom's in trouble with the cops, and it's all because of us. <sighs> Bobby! It's all good, boys. I think he got it. <laughs> <laughs> What? Dirty laundry? I don't believe you've met my friends from the drama club. We're saved! <laughs> I want this room spotless by the time I get back. I'm counting on you, Daniel. Mom really got us good, didn't she? I was so scared, weren't you? Blitzana doesn't know fear. I left it in the locker room a long time ago. Oh, wait. <laughs> You're under arrest! Don't shoot! I'm famous! <laughs> yeah, very funny, Daniel. That's how I won my 12th European Cup. <laughs> I know, Erico. You told me yesterday. I did? Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah! What's going on here? My statue. What are they doing to my statue? Uh, I think they're tearing it down, Erico. No! It can't be! No one touches Erico Platana! I'm the greatest footballer in the world! Everyone loves me! Dad, who's that statue of? A uh, tennis player, I think. A real lowlife. <laughs> I knew it. The world has forgotten me. Today they tear down my statue. Tomorrow it's my football jerseys. And then what? My cereal brand? They discontinued your cereal a month ago, Erico. What? No, not the Erico Pops! Don't look, Erico. We both know you'll always be a star, statue or no statue. <laughs> what is it? What's wrong? Ah, you scared me. I thought something had happened to him. Erico, why is your statue in my bed? <sighs> I couldn't sleep last night. Easy. Easy does it. You stole your statue from the park? I didn't steal it, Daniel. I saved it. And what happened to its face? Easy. Ah, easy does it. Nothing. It was always like that. We can't keep your statue here, Erico. It's huge. And it gives me the creeps. Don't listen to him. He doesn't know what he's talking about. What a heartless thing to say, Daniel. Besides, it's only for a few days. Hmm, I'm not sure it's such a good idea, Erico. Daniel. No, Erico. Seriously, it's not a good idea. Oh, Daniel. 
It feels like you're not listening to me. I knew you'd understand. Oh. Daniel, you really got to stop with the yelling. I see it everywhere. Yeah, I made a few copies to confuse burglars. Can't be too careful. That does it, Eriko. I don't want to see your statue anymore. Not in the fridge, or in the living room, or in the shower. <sighs> Fine, I'll put it back in your bed. No! We have to take it back to the park. What, so they can smash it to pieces? Not in my life. Hmm, maybe we could put it somewhere else. On a roundabout? This statue is a monument to my success, Daniel. Its rightful place is in the limelight. But no one can see it if you keep it here. You might as well have destroyed it. Hey, you're right, Daniel. Everyone must be wondering where it is. Without Erico Platana to show them the way, they must be lost and confused. We're coming to you live from the local park where visitor numbers have reached record levels. There's no doubt about what's got people flooding here. A brand new statue, which has completely transformed the atmosphere of the park, has just been unveiled. The sculptor Giuseppe Provolone explains. To me, the old statue represented the past. Money, fame, bling, it didn't speak to me. What really speaks to me is the simple life, real things. I wanted to create something that reminded us that deeper down, we're all citizens of the world. Visitors aren't the only ones to have fallen under the new statue's spell. The silvery skunk, which hasn't been seen in the local area for over 20 years, has returned to the park. Who said animals can't be art lovers? Aww. They don't care, Daniel. My statue's gone, and nobody cares. I'm sorry, Erico, but it's just a statue, you know? Daniel's right. It's not just a statue. In the end, it's not very important. That's true. It's super important. And I didn't even think it was that good. The chin was too small, and the eyes were all freaky. Exactly! It was a masterpiece. You can't just take this on the chin, Platana. It's time to make a big splash. Oh, yeah, and the way your lips were... That's it! You're right, Daniel. I know exactly what to do. That's great, Eriko. I'm glad to hear that, because sometimes I'm not really sure you listen to me. No time to lose. I need a big roll of duct tape, a hammer, a plastic bag, a chisel, plus a raspberry smoothie. What for? We're back in the local park where things have taken a dramatic turn. The new statue has vanished. In its place, a ransom note left by the abductor, which is disturbing to say the least. Uh, how does this thing work? Nope, got it. Hello, I'm in possession of your new park sculpture that was scandalously put in place of the statue of Erico Platana, the greatest footballer in the world. Allow me to remind you that he's not only rich and famous, but he also happens to be a social media influencer, a part-time model, an audacious businessman. Airtime restrictions mean we've had to cut short this section of the video, which spends 47 minutes describing the footballer's career and muscular physique. Philosopher and hairstylist, if you ever want to see your statue again, you must meet my demands. I want a new statue of Erico Platana twice as big as the old one! Or else... The video arrived with a piece of the statue, which had been chopped off as a threat. Investigations are underway to discern the motives of this psychopath. In the meantime, the park has been closed until further notice, leaving art lovers inconsolable. They took it from me! They took it from me! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Daniel, we agreed to turn down the yelling, remember? What have you done, Erico? I sent them a message. Let's see if they care a bit more now. And what was this smoothie for? <sighs> That's enough, Erico! This time you've gone too far! You have to take the statues back! Because of you, the park is closed, and that nice sculptor is very sad.
It's a power struggle, Daniel. We can't give up now. Believe me, just a few more videos like that and they'll build me a new statue in no time. <sighs> okay, Eriko. But I might have a better plan. I'll need some rope, wooden planks, a drill, wheels, and multicolored modeling clay. What for? <laughs> So, Daniel, what's this plan about exactly? No! You dirty rat! <laughs> Daniel! <laughs> no one double crosses Erica Watana, Daniel! No one! If you so much as scratch my statue, you'll have me to answer to! What are you doing? Ah! No! Well done. Bravo, Daniel. You're the one who made me lose control. Don't you act all innocent, Daniel. You wanted my statue gone, too. Just like everyone else. I couldn't care less about your statue. Well, I do care, okay? I'm a star, Daniel. Ugh. You don't know what it's like to give up everything you are overnight. I'm sorry about your statue, Eriko. But since you came to live with me, my life has changed too, you know? Yeah, how? I had to get used to waking up earlier because you don't like to sleep in. I don't watch cartoons anymore because you only like football. I had to learn to hold on when I need the bathroom because you spend two hours and 45 minutes in there every morning. And I wear lace-up shoes because you're afraid of Velcro. Gee, oh, the sound it makes is terrifying. I, I didn't know you changed all that for me. I don't mind, Eriko, because you're my best friend. Uh, we have to take him back to the park, don't we? Mm-hmm. A genuine miracle has taken place at the park. The new statue has been found safe and sound, putting a smile on everyone's faces. <laughs> it came back to me! It came back! The statue of Eriko Platana has also resurfaced. The town council will proceed with plans to demolish it as soon as possible. Don't worry, Eriko. As soon as you get your body back, <laughs> we'll build you an even bigger statue. That's nice of you, Daniel. <clears throat> uh, by the way, what was that multicolored modeling clay for? Surprise! Now you have a mini statue in the meantime. <sighs> what have you done with my chin? Oh, wow! Tell me about that one! Again? You know that story by heart. Oh, come on, please! Oh, fine, okay. <clears throat> In 2011, Platana's hairstyle not only shocked millions of spectators, it also completely reinvented Mohawk Sideburns. Mohawk Sideburns? Hmm. You know, speaking of hairstyles, Daniel, it's about time we take care of yours. Really? But, uh, Mom is the one who cuts my hair. Oh, Daniel, Daniel. Don't you think the greatest football player on the planet would also be the greatest hairstylist on the planet? Hmm? Huh? Uh, okay. Oh, I knew you'd come to your senses. So, given the shape of your head, we're gonna have to be a little creative. Good morning, world. Good morning, my little kettle. Good morning, my little squashes. <laughs> Good morning, my lower back. Good morning, my little cup. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, 3 p.m. already? Time to get ready for practice. Good afternoon, my little hazelnuts. Say, where's Daniel? See 
Isu, you look like a kneecap that tried to grow a beard. <laughs> <laughs> you look like an old fogey trying to look younger. <laughs> you know who you look like? You look exactly like... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Today's, today's practice is canceled. I'm just not feeling up to it. <laughs> Maple, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to make fun of you. <laughs> oh. Nice work, Sisu. Now Maple will never want to coach us again. He always tied my laces for me. <laughs> he always made the coolest cupcakes. Where are we gonna get a new coach now? <laughs> when they assigned this team to me, everyone said it was a lost cause. Who are you? Boy, were they ever wrong. You guys stink, but that's about to change. I'm gonna turn you into champions. <laughs> Any questions? Uh... You're off the team! Everyone else, ten laps! <laughs> uh, are you sure you know what you're doing, Eriko? Uh, you've never coached a team before. Daniel, shh, Daniel. Has it ever occurred to you that the greatest football player and hairstylist on the planet would also be a champion coach? Uh, is champion coach a thing? Hey! Don't think I can't see you dragging your feet! I'm gonna sculpt your pudgy little bodies into winning machines! <laughs> Thirsty? A real champion licks the dew off the field! You're off the team! What's this? Uh, You're off the team! <laughs> Maya, what do you think of the new coach? She's an insecure tyrant who will drive us into utter chaos and disaster. Maya, is that Velcro laces I see on your shoes? You're off the team! Have fun without me! <laughs> That's enough! Eriko, we need to talk. You're off the team! Oh, it's you. Sorry, Daniel. Uh, so, what's up? You can't just get rid of everyone. I'm the only one left. Ah, uh, no. There's still, um, uh, Steven? <laughs> You're off the team! Oh, well, uh, if they don't have what it takes, we'll just buy better players. Is that it? I told you we had no money. No one is that broke. Maple must have stashed some cash somewhere. <laughs> so what do we have here? Nothing. 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 Well, there has to be something. How can somebody be this broke? Seriously. <gasps> Erica, wait! We need to get the hazelnuts to come back. What? Never. Changing your mind makes you look weak. We need them. Trust me. It's never too late to put the pieces back together. Now we can get back to practice. No, Eriko! You might be the greatest football player in the world, but Maple is a better coach than you! 
Are you kidding? Maybe one day you'll be a great coach, but right now we need to find Maple. Hey, hey, good morning, world. What's up, hot chat? Nice tie. Hey, Hansel. Hop back at you. Hiya, Sylvia. How you doing? Hey. What's the best way to make a small fortune in the stock market? Start off with a big fortune. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Patrick. Good one. Bye, bye. Sell, sell! Bye, for goodness sake! Maple, mm -hmm. you here? Wow, Maple! Daniel? We're sorry about everything. Is everything okay, Michael? Children aren't allowed on the sales floor. Everything's fine, Jane. I've got it under control. We're sorry about everything, Maple. That's not my name anymore, Daniel. I've left that life behind me. And here we go! We're really sorry, Maple! Really, really sorry! <laughs> Is everything okay, Michael? We failed! Maple isn't coming back. No more hazelnuts. No more, no more hazelnuts. Bye. Hmm? Aww. Guys? What up? Maple? I'll never abandon you again. <laughs> the program today is... Meditation and Tribal Percussion. Yeah! <laughs> well, my work here is done. I'm leaving. Wait, 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 wait. Don't I get a song? <sighs> Goodbye, Mr. Coach. We sure had fun, but now, now it's, it's done. done. Now it's done! Yeah. Make me proud, kids. And don't forget, never give away my autograph for free. Daniel, such amazing progress. I'm flabbergasted. So, how do you like those new magic sneakers? They're not magic, Erico. I know you made that up just to show me that the power to win was all along in my heart. <laughs> what? Of course they're magic. I bought them from the sorcerer. Huh? You mean they're really magic? Now that you mention it, I think he said cursed. Your cursed sneakers! Cursed, yep, he definitely said cursed sneakers. <laughs> you can't throw away a gift! With those sneakers, you'll be a champion in three weeks! Cheating is wrong! And your sneakers are freaking me out. Yeah, I'll never get my body back at this rate. How's that for cursed? What's the matter? 
matter? It's the sneakers, Eriko. They're back on my feet. I'm cursed. Cursed! Stop making it all about you. Think of the team. Did you see their faces when you were playing with them yesterday? Their eyes were filled with pride, love, and dare I say hope. They were? They were. But hey, if you want to throw their dreams in the old trash can, that's totally your call. Just get rid of the sneakers. Hmm? Also, if you keep them, you and I are both the same. Both cursed. <laughs> cursed! Great game out there, Daniel. So great that it's making me jealous. So great that... So great that I feel like a loser. I'm so jealous. We're just not good enough anymore. What's your secret, Daniel? What's your secret? I'm begging you, Daniel. Tell us your secret. I'm begging you. <sighs> I'm not really supposed to say anything, but... Hmm? I'm begging you! It's my sneakers. <gasps> hey, are we cursed or what? <laughs> cursed! I'm so glad you came around in the end. The sorcerer told me you'd get used to the side effects. The what? <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I can't sleep. It's only flies and weird voices. Go back to sleep. It's not that. It's the bed. And my sneakers are being mean to me. Hmm? Oh, my sneakers are being mean. We'll see about that tomorrow on the field. I'm not sure I like being cursed. Hey, you're not the only one cursed here. Do you hear me whining? Uh, yeah, all the time. Hmm, being a champion isn't easy, okay? Come on, go back to sleep. <sighs> hmm? Hey, what's going on? Daniel, is it me or are they all wearing cursed sneakers? I might have shown them my pair. And the Sorcerer's Online shop. And sponsored them to sign up. Sign on the dotted line with your blood. 15% off your next purchase. What a bargain. Mm -hmm. Ouch! Curse my aching back! <laughs> Curse. Or did the level just go up a notch around here? This is awful, Erico! The hazelnuts are cursed! Let's not jump to conclusions, Daniel. Once I bought the cape and the hat, I couldn't let the belt and the gauntlet pass me by. Said, let's not jump to conclusions. Ah! I shouldn't have bought the cursed earrings. <laughs> okay, we may have gone a bit too far. Mm -hmm. ah! Listen up. <clears throat> sure, these sneakers have raised our game. Mm -hmm. But look at what we've become. Hmm. Daniel's right! It's not really nice on the other side! We won't play so well if we take them off. But at least we'll be ourselves again. <laughs> no more curses! No more curses! We sure had a good scare, right? Yes, but all's well that ends well. Psych! I wasn't even scared. <laughs> <laughs> No! Oh no! I forgot! Why do they always come back? Ah, 
shouldn't have gone for the lifetime guarantee. Okay, let's go see the sorcerer. But I warn you, you're doing the talking. Well, yeah, the screams, yeah. Well, maybe you shouldn't have signed up for the Full Moon Special Offer. What can I do for you? It's the cursed sneakers. We don't want them anymore. Uh, sorry! Mm -hmm. No refund or exchange on the cursed items. <whistles> hmm? Sorcerer speaking. Please, Mr. Sorcerer. We'll do anything to get rid mm -hmm. of them. An evil pressure cooker? Let me just see what's in stock. <laughs> you okay? I should have never turned my massage therapist into a party hat. Maybe what you need is a little back rub. Come on, any day now. Good luck, kid. Oh, cold hands. I can't stand cold hands. <laughs> oh, my aching back. Hmm. I'll never be able to take back all those sneakers. Mm. I can't. I just can't do it. Take this, Eriko. What's that? It's my magic pet rock. It'll give you strength. Are you kidding me? Trust me, with this stone, you can do anything. Daniel, knock off the baloney! It is baloney, right? Oh, yes! <laughs> yeah, right there! Ooh, ooh. Oh, yeah, on the lower back! Harder! <laughs> oh, you have magic hands. Oh, thanks, I feel like a new man! Come on, kids, in you go! You were right, Daniel. That pet rock is magic. I felt its energy spread through my body. It was incredible. <laughs> Fooled you! There's no such thing as magic pet rocks. It was just an old pebble I found in my pocket. The real magic was in your heart all along. Uh, Erico? I don't know when or how, but one day I'll get my revenge and you'll spend your life regretting this little joke. What? No, nothing. I mean, ha, 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 you really got me this time. <laughs> <laughs> no more curses! Huh, speak for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I slept like a cherub on a cloud. And look at all these pollinating insects. That's just what our vegetable patch needs. And just when I thought my day couldn't get any better, look what I found in the trash! Huh? Ooh. Daniel, this time you are going down. Combo, combo, supreme humiliation. No! This controller's broken. Give me yours. I'm off, sweetheart. Have a good day with your best friend. Ha! <laughs> what do you mean, Mom? It's just me. Oh, Daniel, how could you forget Mr. Tickles? Oh yeah. <laughs> Mr. Tickle sure is my best friend in the world. Be good, you two. And not too much TV, okay? Maybe you want a little space just for you and your best friend. Come on, Erico. Mr. Tickles is just my cuddly toy. Didn't you ever have one? My cuddly toy? I had completely forgotten. Such a nice smell. 
like vanilla and warm bread. Had a little mustache. And actively took part in several revolutions. Huh? Abuelita, my old nanny. She's the one who looked after me when I was little. Ah. Anyway, that's all in the past. Who knows where she is today? Hmm. Hmm. Old nanny. You know I hate surprises. Ta-da! Abuelita! Kill me, Fabas Titi. Abuelita! I can't believe it! I've missed you so much! Miti Mavistranjan. Songoi. Setiju Treamusas. She says that I'm too skinny and that we'll need to fat me up. Are you sure she can see well? Oh, Pichu Pluma del Caboso, Chopolo Bamba Marcia Baila. There's so much to tell you. So many victories, zero defeats, some doubts. <laughs> some doubts. Ah, Daniel, this is kind of personal. Could you give us a little space, please? Back up. More? The door. Can I come back now? No! How about now? No! How? No! Uh, there we go. Unchanged over the centuries, fly fishing is more than just a sport. For some fly fishermen, it's Can we part. switch to cartoons instead? <laughs> Abuelita loves documentaries. The laws are often made by the fly fishermen themselves, <sighs> taking long hours of meticulous preparation. <sharp inhale> That's the end of our program. And now, a look at the reproductive cycle <sighs> of jellyfish. Contrary to popular belief, jellyfish do... <gasps> <gasps> what? Already? We've got to take Abuelita back to her retirement home. <sharp inhale> Look, she's sleeping. We don't want to disturb her. Mm. Hey, where am I gonna sleep? Shh! Old people's sleep is sacred. She's so adorable when she sleeps. Mm. There we go. I've got tickets for mini motorcycling. Awesome! Oops, but I only have two. Looks like Abuelita will have to go back to the retirement home. Hmm? But it's too rough for someone her age. You kidding? She survived several wars. What's a mini bike track to her? Hey, Daniel, do you like donuts? <laughs> What's that? Practice! She played for the national team. Still in good shape, huh? Kian me faras chichi. Abuelita! Abuelita! Tomorrow we can squeeze in canoeing just after laser tag if we don't spend too long bowling. What? But we were supposed to go to the game together tomorrow! I even got us matching ball caps. You want us to just leave, Abuelita? Have you no heart? That does it! Ever since Abuelita got here, you've spent all your time with her! Come on, why so jealous, Daniel?
Abuelita, you haven't seen Daniel, have you? Please to support me. Don't tell me he's still sulking. <laughs> ah! Daniel? What are you doing? Since you like Abuelita better, I decided to become an old lady, too. Take that wig off! You look ridiculous, Daniel. Abuelita, I hope you and Erico are happy. Still huh? no news of Mrs. Sylvia Martinez, who has disappeared from her retirement home. Mom has never done this before. The kids are absolutely devastated. Sylvia, estás mi filino. Erico, are you really, really sure that this is Abuelita? Now that you mention it, her eyes were green and she had a wooden leg. What? Hey, you're the one who told me it was her. I wasn't sure, but you seem so happy. That means... We've kidnapped an old lady! Okay, we need to take her back, right now! But everybody's looking for her, Erico. If somebody recognizes her outside, we're gonna go to prison! To prison! If you have any information regarding the disappearance of Mrs. Martinez, please contact the police immediately. No! Okay, stop, stop. We're gonna find a solution, Daniel. Orange doesn't suit me at all. Ugh, and close that window! Abuelita's gonna catch a cold. Old people's health is sacred, Daniel. Oh no, my hat! My scarf as well! And my funny glasses! Hmm. Coast is clear, Erico. It's you! I know you. I saw you on TV. The dress of my dreams! <sighs> there you are! I knew I'd find you! My self-esteem. Wait, 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 wait! Forgetting your bus ticket? <sighs> wait, 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 wait! You think I don't see what's going on with your old mustachioed friend? He gets a senior citizen discount! <sighs> wait, 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 wait! Have a splendid day! One. Uh, a little too festive, right? <laughs> ah, there you go. That one's scary. Phew. We drop her here, ring the bell, and run for it. Ready, Daniel? Hmm. What are you waiting for? I can't do this. I just can't leave Abuelita like this. But she's not Abuelita. How would you know? You said she had a wooden leg! Well, lizard's tails grow back! Abuelita, you want to go? Vima truffles means tulta bando. Mrs. Martinez, we were so worried about you. That's it. She's gone now. So what did she say when she was hugging us? She said that as we go forward in life, leaving memories behind, we should keep them in our hearts and learn to cherish them. Aww. It was either that or let me go inside. It's freezing out here. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> That's my 
Daniel. Come on, you're almost there. <laughs> Woohoo! Almost! Almost? Are you kidding me? Nice job, Hazelnuts. If we play like that tomorrow, we'll really show Mr. Maslovich a thing or two. Mr. Maslovich? Mr. Maslovich? The scout for the Premier League? That guy's the most influential person in the biz. If he asks you inside the limo, jackpot! But if he kicks you to the curb, it's over. This is the chance of a lifetime! Chance of a lifetime! Not yet. If Mr. Maslovich sees Daniel now, his career is dead in the water. He'll never be a football star and I'll never get my body back! Unlike the hare, rabbits live in groups and dig burrows that... I need a plan. Maslovich must never see Daniel play. You see that, Erico? <laughs> Buddies are eating the football field. Not now, Daniel. Ruining the football field, yes, but how? They're saying rabbits can eat three times their own body weight in grass. Not now, Daniel! Eat the grass. That's it. But who would do that? They're calling rabbits the plague of the pitch, the terror of the turf. Hold on, Daniel. Hmm, rabbits. Rabbits? That's the answer. I'm a genius! Hazelnuts, we must fix the field before Mr. Maslovich shows up. I'm sure he'll be back in a few years. All right, back to training. This is all your fault! Mm -hmm. You're just so... You're just so... So adorable! about a rodent problem? Yeah, it's about time. I called you guys over five minutes ago. Stop! Don't you hurt them! <clears throat> they belong here, too! Mm -hmm. Hands off the groundhogs! Rabbits, Dad. They're rabbits. Hmm. Okay. Yay! Yay! We did it, Hazelnuts! The people's voice has been heard! Hang on! We may have won this time, but they'll be back. We need to form a resistance. Yellow? Mom, you should sit down. I've got some heavy, heavy news. Did you trip over your laces again? You want the boo-boo song? <sighs> I'm not coming home tonight, Mom. The team needs me here to save the rabbits' lives. I don't know when I'll be back, but I know when duty calls. Okay, so which cuddly toy do you want me to bring over? Friends, my toys, rabbits, and marshmallows. This is heaven, Erico. This huh? is heaven? Oh, yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo Rastafari. This is a nightmare, Daniel. Mm. Everyone's running around barefoot and the field is wrecked. That's okay. It'll grow back. Oh, yeah? What about my body? Will my body grow back, too? How are you gonna practice? You know, Erico, there's more to life than football. Ah, uh, 
I think you made a new friend. <sighs> Would you stop it? No! Fluffy likes tiny slices. Let me do it. Snowball's belly there. She hates that. Let me do it. Hmm. No! You have to brush top to bottom, otherwise Thumper doesn't like it. Let me do it. No! Let me do it. No! Let me do it! No, Daniel! We've got a real bond, Jeremy and I. It's not Jeremy, it's Thumper! Okay. Hmm. Daniel won't let anyone do anything. Yeah! yeah. He even made Steven cry. Hmm? <laughs> Jeremy! It's okay. It's just my allergies. We need to do something. Yeah! <laughs> Get off my back! Hmm? Settle down, Hazelnuts. If we simply open our minds, Mother Nature will tell us what to do. Give up on Daniel. That'll teach him. Huh? Well, this one didn't take long. You're all leaving? What about the rabbits? You leave us no choice. You're hogging the rabbits, Sisu. You. You. Jeremy! <laughs> what? Don't worry, Chestnut. We don't need any of them. Just you, me, and Erico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just the one kid. I'll bring a big cage. They're multiplying like... like... No! Well, like rabbits. You ratted us out, Erico. Yeah, I'll call you back. How could you do that to Ginger? And to Patches? And to Cinnabon? And to Snowball? And to Roger? Oh, wait. That one's Fiona. I always get them mixed up. <laughs> Since these rabbits arrived, you've forgotten something, Daniel. My curse! Getting my body back. Getting my life back. My curse! It's always about you, Erico. Forget it. You really let us down. Listen up. Our enemy will be here soon. But together, we are more than just a group. My fellow bunnies, we're a whole No one takes these bunnies as long as I'm here. Hmm. Okay. Here you go. Oh, this is all my fault, Erico. I'm the reason the hazelnuts all left. The rabbits had to go, Daniel. Practice comes first. How else am I going to get my body back? <laughs> Floppy. We gotta get them out of there! <laughs> it's... it's over, Daniel. We've lost. Bunnies are our buddies! Bunnies are our buddies! Bunnies are our buddies! Guys, you came back! The little people always conquer, Daniel. We couldn't let your selfishness destroy the cause. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Mm, okay. okay. Erico, hmm? what are we going to do with all these rabbits? Leave it to me. Ah, 
Is this the life or what? Yeah! Wait, where's Floppy? I made a few calls. Trust me, this won't be the last time we hear about Floppy. to lose only one shin guard. Oh, I don't know, Eriko. Whee! Whee! <laughs> <sighs> well, let's take a look through my old things and see what we can find. Oh. <laughs> You're too young for this. Uh, this is not mine. Oh, <laughs> I was sure I threw that away. Aww. Are these drawings from when you were a kid? No, that's from a couple years ago. Sketches from my graphic novel. You used to draw comics, Eriko? Uh-uh-uh. Graphic novels, Daniel. I've always made time to explore my many talents. Eriko Platana is a complete artiste. Joel, the cheeky squirrel. All oh, the adventures we had together. His best friend is a talking tire? You bet! This project was pure genius from start to finish. But anyway, that's all in the past now. Why'd you give it up? No time, Daniel. What with games, interviews, selfies. When you're a superstar, there's no time for hobbies. Too bad you stopped. You sure don't have those problems anymore. Maybe not now, but I intend on getting my body back soon. So get your butt in gear, Daniel. <laughs> Even better than the real thing. Eriko, look! I made myself a new shin guard. Are you coming? We're gonna be late for practice. Just in time. I need a fresh pair of eyes. You're back to the drawing board? I couldn't resist the call of Joel. I've drawn pages and pages since yesterday. It's like it was always in me. What do you think? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well, it rocks, right? I've already called ten different publishers. Uh, um, the drawing of the clouds is funny. The fight scene? You're holding it upside down. <laughs> You know what, Eriko? Comics are nice, but you already know where your true talents lie. Of course. How could I forget? Now I remember the scent of leather, the squeak of souls. That was my real passion, Daniel. Shoe making! What? Ha! <laughs> Graphic illustrator, what was I thinking? Being a shoemaker is my true calling. But what about practice? Not now, Daniel. I have to strike the leather while it's hot. But you'll come to see me play, right? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'll be there later. Okay, Eriko. You're making your dad That's proud, my son. baby girl. Huh. Erico, you didn't come see me at practice. Daniel? Ah, just in time. The Welton gave me a stitch, but I got the upper hand at last. You made me shoes? Not just any shoes. Platanas. The shoe I've always dreamed of making. Stylish, comfortable, and high performance. 
I know. Breathtaking. Go on, try them on. Uh, I don't know, Erico. Go on, tell me what you think. It's just a couple hours' work, you know? <laughs> and a lifelong dream. <laughs> Well, am I a genius or what? There, uh... I've never had shoes like these before. <laughs> you better believe it. Good. I'll call the factory. Feet all around the world are gonna be singing my name. No! I mean, uh, shoemaking is great and you've uh, got a... Oh, got a gift. But maybe you should put that aside for the moment, you know? So you can concentrate on your real talent. Holy cow, Daniel. Of course. Now I remember. The applause, the glitz, the glamour, the beating of Dove's wings. Magic! How could I have been so blind? That's my true calling. No, Erico, it's foot... Abracadabra! <laughs> Okay, I may be a little rusty. Can you at least come see the match this afternoon? Yeah, yeah, don't worry. You promise? Yeah, 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 I promise. Is it this one? No. Okay, then. Is it this one? No. No, oh, I must have dropped it. Oh, of course! My nail arts kit! Huh. My makeup set, my hairdressing equipment, my old paintball gear, my DJ turntable, my ventriloquist puppet. What's up, Daniel? My propane barbecue. Oh, don't worry, I've got my volunteer fireman's helmet in here somewhere. Hey, what's this? Rough around the edges, but inspiration takes time, Daniel. Sorry, Mr. Box, but you need to go away. It's better for everybody. Don't do it, Daniel! You can't throw me away like that without talking to Erico first! But he won't listen to me. You know how he gets when he's fixated on something. I agree. It's the only way. But if you do that, you'll regret it for the rest of your life! Don't pay attention to him, Daniel. You can never trust a puppet. But you're a puppet, too! <laughs> Daniel? Did you come to do some fly fishing, too? Hey! That's my stuff! You've got to stop this, Erico! Every 20 minutes, you switch obsessions! You'll never get your body back if you stop training me! I can't help it if I'm good at everything! Like I said, I'm a complete artiste! But you're not a complete artiste! You're not good, Erico! Sculptures are pretty average. <laughs> but at football, you're a genius. That's more than enough. Huh. Gee, thanks, Daniel. I thought we were friends. I'll see you later, dream crusher. Hmm. Fine, Joel, you win. Erica will never play football again. Hmm? Hmm? Hey! <gasps> Can I help you? Or have you just come to shatter my dreams again? No, I've come to save them. Do you know what's in every frame of your comic? A gripping narrative and hysterical jokes? No. A uh, football. And do you know what's all over your shoes? 
quality, and a painstaking attention to detail. Plates! Your nail art? Football! Your hairdressing? Football! 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 I don't see what that proves. It's just a coincidence. It proves that football has always been your true passion. You put it in everything you do. Oh, come on. What about my ice sculpture, then? Wow. You're right, Daniel. No matter what I do, football always runs through my veins. But that's a good thing, Eriko. It means that you're really into your passion. And on top of that, you're a superstar! Oh, yeah? And if I never get my body back, what happens to the superstar then? If I really can't be the best player in the world anymore, what will become of me? The best coach in the world. And anyway, you'll always be a superstar to me. Oh, Daniel. My saxophone? Ditch it. My hand-painted plates? Ditch them. There's just one thing left. Ah! <gasps> Shin guards! Ah! I knew I put them somewhere. This is a disaster! Our line of children's choice is tanking! The Erico Platana styling head was a total failure! <laughs> no one leaves this room until we have a new idea! There's... <clears throat> There's always that funny foosball table prototype. Yeah. Yeah. I love it! You are fired! Even our factory manager has better ideas, and he's a panda! <laughs> we need something new, something different. Hmm? And then I said, pass, pass! And I didn't know he was gonna pass, but then he made me a pass! What a day! Hmm, that's it. Platana footballs! High-tech talking footballs that speak in Eriko's voice! Every kid will want one! Yeah! Bravo! Yay. Thank you. It was a team effort. Which reminds me... Everybody is fired! Lame. 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 You'd have to be a total moron to watch TV these days. Lame. Super lame. You there? I hate complaining by myself. Hang on, I'm drawing something for Mom. Hmm? Hmm. The composition makes no sense. Your color choices are horrendous. And you've crossed over the lines here, here, and here. That's not very nice. You're gonna be tackled by things in life. This is how you improve. So, are you coming or what? Hey, you! Love football? Love Erico Platana? What if your favorite football player suddenly became your favorite toy? Wow. We're gonna have a ball together! Best friends, best friends forever! <laughs> With the Erico Platana talking football, you too can become a champion! Best friends, best friends forever! The Erico Platana football is always there for you! I don't wanna move out! We'll make a great team, you and me! This lousy toy. I never agreed to this. <laughs> uh, are you kidding me? No way I'm gonna let all those kids kick me around. Come on. It seems you're selling like hotcakes. Wait till my lawyers hear about this. Oops. Sorry, Steven. Oh, no! I camped in front of the store for three days! There we go. I'll always be there for you. Phew. I thought I lost you. The greatest battles are won with the heart. Does that mean you're not angry anymore? Go hard or go home! Yay! Go home! <laughs> Junior? Do you remember that time Daddy sat on your game console? Wow! Did you get me a new one? <gasps> Don't touch me, I'm super rich! Do you like it? It's, uh, talking football. It's all the rage with the kids. Daddy really broke the piggy bank on this one. 
<laughs> I'll let you guys get to know each other. Wow, nice decor. Well, I'm out of here. Lame, lame, lame. <laughs> Only a complete moron would watch TV these days. <laughs> lame. 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 Oh no! I went over the lines again! To win, hmm? you need to think outside the box. You really think so? The greatest battles are won with the heart. I did it with my heart. We make a great team, you and me. <laughs> The sky's the limit. Thanks, Eriko. You've been so nice lately. I've never felt so happy. The sky's the limit. Eriko. The sky's the limit. Eriko. El cielo es el limite. Seven blocks. Solar guiding that or I swapped him with a toy. I'm this! Woo! No, he must be a toy. Or maybe! Eriko! Now I found one of your action figures behind the couch. What is it? Isn't this a putrid marauder of chaos? No, that's an old piece of chewing gum. <laughs> Huh, yeah, sorry. Ooh, I do love my dad, but sometimes, seriously. I know, right? Lame. Hey. What's up? Isn't that a putrid marauder of chaos? No one badmouths my dad except me. Hey, no one badmouths my dad except me. Mm. How do I take out your batteries? Uh, wait, what are you doing? It's me, your BFF. <laughs> oh. hmm? Hey, there's something wrong with your kid. What? Is Junior sick? Oh, I had to pick the Einstein family. They're as bad as each other. I won't let some toy talk smack about my son or his father. Dad, have <laughs> you seen my football? <laughs> no, 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 no. This ball is a bad influence. I'm taking it back to the store right this second. Yes! I hope we kept the receipt. Hmm. Ew. Come on, Pops! Let's go! I don't have all day! Ah. <sighs> Erico! Erico! It's scandalous! <sighs> Martin, we've got another defective ball. And it insulted my son. Hmm. Oh, freedom. Oh! I want to speak with my lawyer. Oh, I'm never going to find him. There's been a mistake. I'm not a toy. I'm not a toy. I'm not a toy. I am your best friend. <laughs> Erico, where are you? Winning isn't everything. It's the if only you thing. Your heart team dreams will come true. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Here. Open your eyes. This would be a whole lot easier if you were a bit more encouraging. Erico, I'm stuck. <laughs> it's like. 
with the ball pool. I mean, I like the ball pool. <laughs> but in fact, it's not like the ball pool. Less talking, more doing, Tanya. I've always believed in you. Hurry up! Criticize me all the time! If you listen to your heart, nothing is impossible! See? They all believe in me! They're all encouraging me! Because they're programmed to do that! But I say something I don't sugarcoat it! But at least I mean it! Victory is at your feet! Why do you think I'm always on your back? It's because I know you can do it, Daniel! Welcome, Eriko. I prefer a friend who tells the truth. Add some more blue there. Well? Hmm. It's... um... Uh, better. Hmm. Hmm? Here, Mom! This is for you. Hmm? Aw, oh, thank you, sweetie. It's beautiful. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's colorful. <laughs> <laughs>